I'll be showing you this design for a hybrid Merlin Blackbird camera stabilizer that builds off all sorts of great ideas people have been sharing. It uh, has a few distinct advantages I'll point you to. First of which is this is built entirely with off-the-shelf parts that are cheap, uh, readily available, and requires no special tools to construct top to bottom. It's also designed to accept this Manfrotto base plate which makes it great for quick changes in the field. Uh, and of course uses a gimbal design uh, that many folks have used out there that I'll touch on briefly. Another thing I'll point out as you look for this PVC uh, arm as the extender, uh, look for this lower profile, smaller angle version, not the one I'm holding in my hand. I'm going to go quick on the gimbal here because there's lots of great DIY videos that use this design. Uh, the little quirk I'll point out is the hose cap that I've used on this PVC adapter that sandwiches it to the top railing. We'll just point out that I cut the ends off this PVC shim or connector and that's what I used to help seat with some rubber cement the two skateboard bearings that are inside the top and bottom of this unit. Also used the full version of this uh, at the bottom here uh, slid a rubber bite grip and there you have it a uh, gimbal that uses uh, that popular Traxxas uh, 5151 RC drive shaft design. A design that lots of people are using that I find works real well. Okay. Hey everybody. I've been working on a steady cam. Been wanting one for a while. I've seen the Merlin. I can't afford it. Who can? <laughs> Love to have it, but just can't, uh, just can't do it. Um, so I've been w trying to make my own. Looked at a lot of stuff online. There's a lot of great DIYs out there. This is my first DIY, so bear with me if it's not as smooth and fluid as as most would like it to be. But do my best. So I've uh, worked with a lot of different incarnations here. This is my final handle assembly. One of the early arms I've built. Conduit PVC, easy to do. I've uh, been through skate bearings and such, Traxxas U joints, um, and I think that I've come up with my final design. I'm really, really happy with this, so I'm going to try to walk through how I.